Hi, I'm Steve. Um, I am a painter and an art educator. I am originally from Minot, North Dakota, and I've been in Fargo for 10 years or so, um, building my art career and building my teaching career. So if we talk about my, my large pieces, that has to start with pop art. Um, definitely, because everything from a very young age with me spawned from like seeing Roy Lichtenstein's work and Jasper Johns, like they were just like my idols. And so once I started studying them more and more, then um, it kind of gave me this idea, okay, I want to do pop art, but I want to do it in my own way. And so that's where Metal Arcs came out of it and Bison came out of it and Teddy Roosevelt and, and trying to take things that are meaningful to me, um, but to give them to the public and a new fresh and exciting way and something that I, I could be proud of. Um, and so that kind of helped me bring in maps and all these other things into my work that would set it apart, uh, make it different. And so that's kind of how the large pieces kind of took, um, took their form. And then I kind of started thinking, okay, I've worked huge, now let's go small. And so then I started looking closer and instead of where am I from as state, where am I from right now? And I think that's where the smaller pieces came from, thinking about where am I in Fargo, and then how did I get to Fargo? And so I got to Fargo from Minot, so I, I took kind of a personal journey, thinking of, okay, I drive this all the time, um, this four and a half hour journey, but I never really focus on what's around me. And so I, I, I just started snapping pictures the whole way, and then I just started building a series of work based on five hours of driving. I guess this, <laughs> this whole year has been kind of like a, kind of a journey. Um, a lot of just everyone around me seemed to be going through a journey somehow. And so I, I kind of just dove into like music I grew up with this like past year. And so um, basically I listened to like nothing but Jackson Brown. And so like all of these paintings that I did were like I listened to basically Jackson Brown with painting all of them, um, like studying his lyrics because they inspired me so much and then painting the paintings with his music. And so over half of them are named after his songs. Um, spawning off of that in, in October, I actually finally got to see him live in concert. And so it's like all in one year, this all happened. This whole series was happening with these paintings that were kind of, he was in the background the whole time. And then as this was going on, I was able to see him in real life and kind of like witness this, in my opinion, like a hero of mine. The Arts Partnership Artists in Residency program has been important to me because it's forced me to think about my work in a different light. So I'm now having to have my work in a business where people who probably don't do this primarily every day, um, now they get to see the creative side. And so that was kind of my, the biggest reason for me doing it is that it's a chance to be visual and for people to see me and to hear my story and to maybe be inspired. And that's the whole goal is that just to help um, inspire people. 